Welcome back to another episode of The Walking Dead. Um, as you probably know by now, I've been pretty ill recently, so I haven't been able to record anything. Um, but uh, I've got my voice back now, so uh, a little bit groggy still, but uh, I've got my voice back, which is the main thing. Um, so last time I was here, I can't quite remember what was happening. I'm not going to be able to pry these bars with this. Yeah, I think I basically tried all that stuff, didn't I? Last episode. And I think I had one more thing to try up here. Did I try this? Oh, right, yeah, it's off. Okay, okay. It was just this thing here, wasn't it? Um, try that. Ooh, there we go. What the hell? Everything is okay. Use your noggin, mate. Like the Shawshank Redemption. Ah, Chuck. You had a good run. A fallout shelter. <laughs> this isn't giving me good vibes. Oh, is that actual. It must be gone food, though. Enough to keep people alive for months. Ooh. But is actually. Is it still okay? The food. Oh. Ha 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 ha. Who are you? I don't want any trouble. It's all right. It's okay. I, I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Which is why you'd do well to turn around and leave right now. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he goes back there and they find out we're down here. Uh. Are you from Crawford? They don't lie to me. I know. Where else can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. I'm not from around here. I'm from Athens. Grew up in Macon. Everything's okay, old man. In Macon. Yeah. Right there? How was it? As bad as here. I'm sorry. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than <laughs> Crawford ever showed us. Think, Vernon. Shoot what that do you think bitch. Do if they find out we're down here, right under their feet. Damn it! You're right. Friend him. I'm sorry, friend. Let's talk about this. Risk. Look, I don't want to do this. Let's talk, okay? What's to talk about? You won't even tell us who you are. My name is Lee. I'm a history professor. I don't want to die. Today. Everything's okay, old man. I don't think you want to kill me either. Don't. Don't come any closer, or I'll shoot. Look, Clem Clem needs me. Come on. Let's just talk about this. Vernon, what are you doing? Shoot him! Nobody needs to get shot. Just take it easy. Yes. It's all right. It's okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? Vernon! Get out the way, nice. bitch. God damn. Here to hurt you. See, everything's fine. You're really not from Crawford? Crazy people. No, I'm really not. Well, we are, or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place. You know, started weeding out the sick and the old so their perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. No room for weakness or vulnerability in their little master race. You don't look that old. So, you're sick? We're sick. We're all members of a cancer survivors group that used to meet here at the hospital. We're in remission. But that wasn't good enough for Crawford. They'd already rounded up five of <laughs> us before the rest of us managed to hole up and hide <coughs> from them down here. This old basement's been abandoned for years. What is this? The morgue? Nice place to live. Yeah. Irony's always high on my list when I'm looking <laughs> for a place to survive. How did you find your way down here? We were looking for a My boat. My group and I were up by the river looking for a boat. Now I just want to get out of here and find them again. Gotta be honest. The sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. Can you show me the way back? Those sewers are like a damn maze. Any chance you could help me find my way back? Look, I'd like to help you, but we've all got our own problems. Two of our group are sick and need constant care. 
and I'm the only doctor here. Ooh, you're a doctor, Besides, eh? Besides, why should we help you? Because I'll shoot you if you don't. Uh, Look, sorry if I scared I gotta get back to Glen Glen. I just want to get back to my people. Back to Clementine. She's your daughter? Yes. Yeah. She's probably already wondering where I am. Well, Oops. We both should have said that. But she's like my daughter. It's all right, Bree. I had a daughter, too. Lost her in the first days. I'll be damned if I'll just sit back and let that happen to someone else. We need you here. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't Don't have said that. Oh, well, be cool. Before you know it. Let's go see about your daughter. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Maybe I should have said no. Ah, oh, no. Clem Clem's like my daughter. It's all good. Everyone nod to each other. It's all good. Clementine? Clem? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What are you doing? Molly? Oh, hey. You made it back. Yes. Who's this? He didn't tell you about me? Understandable, I guess. I'm the one who put that beating on him when he tried to jump me back at the river. Who's the fossil? He's a doctor. Where's Clementine? Where's Clementine? She's around here somewhere. Relax. I got her and Kenny both back <laughs> safely. You're welcome, by the way. Good. God damn it. I think you have something that belongs to me. Oh yeah. It's got a bit of blood in it now. Um You want to worry about that. Clean it a bit. Cool. Lee, thank God you're back. Krista, what's wrong? It's Omid. He's gotten worse. Much worse. That's just we too bad. Wounded. Who's this? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. Oh, thank God. Could you take a look at him? You have to help us. Please. Ooh. I'll see what I can do. Take me to him. Yeah. I found me a good person. Just look at him once, so he's dead. Walk out the door. Oh, me, honey. You're gonna be all right. Now you know. Lee brought a doctor. All right, let's take a look at him. I work better without an audience. Now, why don't you go find your little girl? <laughs> your little girl, Lol. Clementine. Clementine? Where are you, Clem Clem? Where are you? Don't do this. Clementine, you in here? Where is she? Where is she? Clementine? Where are you, Clem Clem? Can you run a bit faster, please, Lee? We have to find Clem Clem. Oh, Clementine's Clem, drawing. In here? Drawing, 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 drawing. Clem's drawings. But where is she? Oh, look through the office window. Don't see her anywhere out there. Uh, no walkers either, though. But at the same time, I'd rather be have her inside the house. Clam, clam. Should we try in here? Oh, is that where we just came? I don't know. Clementine, door. you here? No. Clem? Well, if... She can't see her now. I'm so. Oh, actually, no, there's more doors. Never mind. Ain't got time for that. <laughs> okay, let's try out the door. Hello. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, you know, just poking around. Yeah. You won't find anything. We already searched the place. You'd be surprised what people miss. Trust me, I've been doing this for a while. Where's Clementine? Don't ask me, I'm not her keeper. Hey, 
Do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with her. Good. Why don't you go bug them? Sure, I will. I'll do that. Examine the drawers. Clementine? <laughs> Lol. I don't care about that. I just want to find Clementine. No sign of her in here. No, no, she's not. Let's just can go find her. Downstairs, then I'm guessing. Uh, can we leave here? There we go. Um, Clem? Clementine? Oh, what's up here? Oh, yeah, of course. Clementine? You up there? Why would she be up there? It just seems a bit strange. Where could she be? No. Through the hallway window? Don't see her out there. In here? Oh, that's, that's, that's the bedroom door still, isn't it? Same one Molly was in, yeah. What's on the floor? No. I'll go try talking to her. Molly? I told you, that girl isn't with me. Go ask your buddies and quit bothering me. Ah, fine. I thought we were buddies, Molly. I thought we were buddies. Okay. Let's, uh... Clementine! Where are you? Bedroom, that's the other bedroom door. Clementine! Come out! Please! Kenny? Drinking his ass off. God damn it. Oh, hey, you made it back. Good job. Good job. What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Get in drunk. Where'd you get the bottle? Found it. You want to throw down again like back on the train? Damn I fight better when I'm shit faced. What the fuck were you thinking letting Kenny get like this? Hey man, I tried, but he gave me a look like he was going to rip my face. <laughs> what was so he annoying. Doing? You think he was going to listen to me? To hell with you. Getting wasted's not going to help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked. Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. Make we one. got walkers all around us. That crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? <laughs> Lol. Staring at him. Clementine! Where the hell are you, Clem Clem? Nothing. Doesn't look like she's in here. Come on, the hell. Doesn't look like she's in here. That is just so creepy, just looking at that face there. <laughs> the hell's up with that? Damn. Uh, Clementine! Come out! Please! Look at the table. No, we would have seen her under there if okay. she was there. It's okay, Lee. Okay, let's try moving into the kitchen. Open the backyard door. Let's try the backyard door. Clementine? Clementine! Where are you going, Clem? Oh, I have a walkie talkie, I remember. I bet she doesn't have the other one. Oh, but the other guy has. The guy's got the other one. Doors covered in lines. Don't think anyone came in through there. Look at the fence. Where are you, Clem Clem? Oh, my God. Where have you gone? I won't be mad at you. Nothing. She must be in the house then. Is 
She has to be in the ass. Oh! Wait! What the hell? 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 Open, 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 open. Get your gun ready. It's gonna be a walker, isn't it? Oh, clam clam. Wee. What the hell? Oh. Hey, girl. Come look. Look what I found. <sighs> oh my gosh. A boat? Is it a boat? It's a boat! Oh my god! Good job, Clam Clam. This was here the whole time? Lol. I know, right? Yeah! Life is good, Kenny. Life is good. Ah, oh, thought we lost the clam clam. How's all me doing, Krista? How's all me? What taking Kenny so long? What's taking Kenny so damn long? How hard can it be to look over a boat? It'll take as long as it takes, Lee. Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. <laughs> Why are you even still here? Yeah. Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Well? You want the good news or the bad news? Uh, the good I news. I think we could all use some good news. Good news is the boat's seaworthy enough. In pretty good shape, mostly. Mostly? That's the bad news. Gas tank's empty and her battery's dead. We need to fix both before she's taking us any place. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? You said straight. You should say put back Crawford. Sounds like Crawford is the one place that has everything we need. Maybe we should try there. No. <laughs> Surely we have to try. If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust ask, me, ask, you don't know lol. these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man, might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst mm -hmm. kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Stroll in and ask him. Because from what I've heard, we that place ain't take what exactly we need by friendly force. to outsiders. That's uh, putting it mildly. We sneak there in. to be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. Yeah. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. Yeah, we do. Yeah. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. That's actually not the worst idea I've ever heard. Yeah. I mean, it's close, but I don't know. Maybe it could work. Yeah, she, she's like a ninja, so she could do it. Never had the this is to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, it's decided then? How do we know how to do it? Crawford? How is okay with this? Anyone else have a problem with this plan? Because we're gonna need every one of us to pull this off. Man, I don't know. Oh, I'm go away, Ben. Kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? Come on, Ben. We go tonight, oh, damn it. Under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. 
That's how I'm still alive. He's pretty cool. I like him. I told you to stay in your room. How long have you been there? Don't be mean to her. Is it going to be dangerous? Maybe. Is what going to be dangerous? Crawford. Yes. Very dangerous. I can't lie to you, Cliff. Yeah, it's going to be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better. We're going to be both working. honest with you. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? I don't want anyone else to die. Me either, Clem Clem. Me either. No one else is gonna die. No one else is gonna die. I promise. You can't promise that. Aww, I'm sorry, Clem Clem. I'm just trying to be nice. No, I guess I can't. Sorry. I guess I should go get ready. Oh, uh, say what now? You said you'd need all of us to do this. Aww. And you said I'm a big help. Remember? I can't help you going in there. Is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? Oh no. I don't think they'll be there. It might be safe with them. It's dangerous where for children. I'm going, it's just too dangerous for children, especially. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. I'm sorry. I want to protect you, Glam Glam. Can't I come with you? Uh, at least it'd be better if you're with me. Okay. Fine. You can come, but you have to promise to stay quiet and do exactly what you're told the whole time we're there. Okay, I'm gonna go get ready. I'll protect you, Clem Clem. Don't you worry about it. Nothing to worry about. Everyone's not going to like it, oh yes. What do you mean you're bringing Clementine? Maybe not. No one seems to care. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? If What's it's about Clem Clem... Took another look at the boat. <laughs> no, maybe not. She's a 30-footer. So? So we're gonna have a capacity problem. Boat that size ain't gonna hold more than five people, even with one of them a kid. Me, you, Clem, Krista, Omi, Ben, Molly. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, that's still one too many. Even if we cut Molly loose. Before this is over, I'm gonna have to make a decision. You're not serious. Look, I'm just saying, if we want the best chance of... What? Oh dear. Oh yeah, they're not coming, are they? Who the hell is this? This is Bree. She can help us. We don't need her. The more the better. Good. There's too much of her. No, I'm kidding. I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. <laughs> she looks like, she looks like the Assassin's Creed guy. Or his name is. <laughs> Hold up just a, <laughs> just a red one. You ready? Ready. Hey, whoa, hold on a minute. <laughs> You're not taking her with us. Did you not hear anything I said about the kind of place Crawford is? If you take her in there she and can they find her... This little girl's not just excess baggage. She's gotten us out of a tight spot more than once. It's true. She's coming. Deal with it. You heard the man. Let's move out. Yeah. She's an important girl. That thanks, Ben. Cool. Well, I guess that'll be it for today. Uh, next time we'll go to Crawford.